that mug has like a whole like private pool. But to be second best, I mean, I'll take it, okay? So we are celebrating my baby's 30th birthday, Dirty 30. So um, yeah, we're about to go ahead and get into this room tour. I'm not even gonna keep y'all waiting. We got an exciting vlog ahead of us and let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, y'all, so we're doing it a little bit different this time. We're doing an MTV crew sale. So welcome to the Excellence El Carmen Excellence Club. We got a sweet treat for y'all. And the first thing when you come in, baby, as you can see, you have the walk-in closet. Ooh, ooh, okay, and it comes with two rows. We love the rows, an extra blanket some towels for the beach, a steamer, and also a beach bag too. It also comes with a safe and this linen bag for your laundry. So, um, yeah, I love how like ducked off it is and you don't even know it's a closet. Like that's definitely the vibe that we're going for. So this next part is the beautiful bathroom. As you can see, it has the two sinks and then you can look in the mirror and then it actually um, allows you to still see the beautiful view, the bedroom and everything else. So they got some Colgate in here. They even got a toothbrush child. So, you know, they're looking as up. <laughs> and then they have these matching slippers to go with the robe. And then you have, what is in here? Oh, this is a hair dryer. But um, you can go ahead and come this way, boo. Because if you open this door, You'll see it has the toilet with the telephone and everything. And then, y'all, I know this is basic. Or, I mean, it's like a simple thing, but look at this towel rack. Like, I just love this towel rack. Like, when I saw this, baby, right, I was like, wait, I need a towel rack like this in my actual house. Because that is just so chic. This is actually the towel that I used to wipe off my hands with. But as you can see, we're coming around. We got the walk in shower with the rain shower plate i've never seen anything like that before have you babe mm -hmm. so like yeah the rain shower plate excellence putting us on to some you know new things or whatever but i love this black silver accents and everything like that so it just screams luxury you know what i'm saying and uh, so yes. now you walk into the room you got the mounted TV, king size bed. You have the full length mirror. So we definitely gonna get some flicks in this. Make sure, you know, head to toe, you looking right. And then in this corner, we have a little office space. And I actually need to pull out my laptop in a second. But yeah, if you need to just do a little bit of work, send some emails, whatever, whatever, you can go ahead and, you know, use that. And on these slides, so you have the sliding here. That is so cool. So if you want to close it off, you can. If you want to open it up, you can. And so this is kind of where, you know, you're going into like the living room area. It's my baby's birthday, as I said before. So they hooked us up with the fresh fruit and then also the bottle of champagne. All right, y'all, so we had to get another angle so y'all can, you know, get the full experience for the lighting and everything. So as I said before, this is like the living room area. And then this is kind of like the turn up nook, as I like to call it. So with the Excellence Club stay, you go ahead and get all of these bottles for free at no extra cost. They actually will keep bringing bottles to your booth. So whenever you finish, all you got to do is put the empty bottle or keep the empty bottle and then they'll go ahead and bring you another one. So we have the ice um, bucket right here. We have the two glasses and then we have like kind of like a coffee tea bar and then we have the coffee maker water and then we got some um coffee stuff in here and then also some tea too and then over here we have the cabinet that hides the refrigerator so we have a full mini bar here also comes complimentary you got your heineken cool light you got a little citrus punch the coca-cola and then you also got some oreos too like they know what they doing okay because i love me some oreos and then they got the water here like i said at no extra cost and they'll just keep stocking it up as you go ahead and use it 
move over here another office space so hey if you want to work and play at the same time you definitely can do it you have a second tv in here so it's almost like you can watch that from the bed if you want to watch something else you can watch it from here so as y'all can see we are very close to the beautiful ocean of dr so i'm gonna go ahead and open this up so, as y'all can see, this is the first balcony. I'm just letting y'all know. Y'all are for a treat. This is only the first balcony. As y'all can see, we actually have access to this pool out here. And so, he said that we actually won't be able to use this, you know, immediate area right here because that's, you know, somebody's room. But we can use this pool. This is our private beach that comes with the Excellence Club. And then we have our own bar over there. And like I said, that comes with Excellence Club too. So like I said, you getting your money's worth when you come to Excellence Club. Go ahead. We was watching a, um, what's it called? We was watching a video and he was like, you know, you work hard, you gotta play hard. So, you know, treat yourself or whatever. And we definitely did for my mother's birthday. So as y'all can see, we got the jacuzzi tub. He said it's heated, cold water, and it has the jets. And then we have this nice bed area. We'll probably put some towels and stuff right there as we just, you know, watch the sunset, watch the sunrise, sunbathe because it is beautiful out here. And we're gonna go ahead and go back in here because it looks like you can enter the jacuzzi from here. So let's go ahead and show this. So right from your living room, you can wake up, Get your champagne, jump right in the pool. And so, as y'all can see, it has like the glass here. It even has these shades, y'all. Like, what? This is just so nice. This is the details for me. Okay, y'all, so like I said, this is only the first part. We're about to take y'all to what made us look here. We're gonna go up here to the second floor. You know, watch this step. It was raining a little bit, but as soon as we got to this resort, it's like the sun came out. So I'm just so excited about that. to worry about the pool closing early we got a 24-hour pool right here mm -hmm. we have the shower over here with the bed the privacy wall day two today we got up and ate some breakfast the omelet was I right. the fresh fruit you know was always good but um yeah we just went back to the room kind of chilled out and now we are at the beach lounging out I try to get some photos but it's 
to windy out here. Sorry if y'all can't hear me. I really did not think it was gonna be this windy in DR. But um, yeah, so this is the area that we're in. It's for Excellence Club members only. So we're just trying to hang out here. Wait on, waiting on the lady to bring us some, sorry it's dark. Waiting on the lady to bring us some drinks. Um, I want a nice little pineapple drink. But yeah, we're just gonna hang out here. I think I want to call the spa and set up our um, hydrotherapy free session because we also get that included with our stay. So I think that would be, you know, fun. It'll be popping. I don't know what it's going to in, entail. I hope I don't, I mean, if I don't, it doesn't entail me like, you know, ducking my head under the water or anything like that. But yeah, the weather feels so good. What time is it? Yeah, it's like 1.30, so we basically have all day to do whatever we want to. Since the weather is good, um, it's way better than I thought it was gonna be, we went ahead and booked the waterfall excursion for tomorrow. I do not know why it just keeps going dark, but we booked the waterfall excursion for tomorrow, so that should be fun. We're just gonna hang out here, and I'll show y'all our drinks when they come. Okay, y'all, so we got our drink. They ain't had no straws. They ain't tell us that before we got <laughs> it. So we literally have enough. Spooling all over our clothes. Having to drink out this coconut. It is good though. Oh, I want this one. What is it? Let me see. It's a pineapple. Yeah, what, what's going on? We're seeing all these drink options on Instagram and they over here talking about, oh, you mean this one? I'm gonna have to start speaking in Spanish so they know what I'm talking about. It was turned at the bar earlier. I don't know what happened. It was playing the baby. Mm -hmm. It was playing the baby. But y'all, it's dark out here, so I'm gonna hook up with y'all when we are back inside, because I don't want it to be too dark. So see y'all later. Okay, y'all, so we came to the grill for lunch, and the way everything is set up is that they have the menus and stuff on the app, and so all you do is go to see more, and then yes. yeah, shows opening hours, and then you see them. Do you need your meal? Yes. My actual meal? Yeah. I do not, but may I have a Caesar salad as an appetizer? Yes, please. Uh, can we have two waters? And so two they got waters. appetizers, salads, burgers. So I don't know what I'm gonna get yet, but I definitely got a salad, cause I need some vegetables. But I might get a sandwich or a wrap. Baby, do you want some um, a dessert? I don't know. I know they have vanilla ice cream for sure. And they got some other stuff on here. But yeah, I think it's pretty cool. I wish you could actually place the order on the app. That would be way better. But yeah, that's basically it. Okay, so we got our appetizers. I hope it's not mayonnaise. I just needed some um, you know, vegetables, y'all. Like, you know, we gotta still keep it healthy while on vacation. So I got this as a little appetizer. And then we're getting burgers for lunch because I am starving. We didn't finish our omelets today. So, I thought it was gonna be a bigger portion of nachos, but how you feeling, babe? <laughs> Excellent day. Excellent day. <laughs> okay, so we got our burger, y'all. And this is what came with it. It came with onions, bacon, whatever cheese that is, and some pickles. But I'm going to the menu. I'll focus. I'm looking at here. It was supposed to come with cheddar cheese. Cheddar cheese, grilled onion, romaine lettuce, Dijon mustard. So, 
it's like I don't know what it is, but they don't be they don't be bringing out what we be ordering, and it's just so confusing sometimes. I mean, we'll eat it or whatever. It's free. It's all inclusive, but y'all need to go back to me, you. we are back from dinner um so the clips that you just saw were from my phone i forgot my camera and i wasn't really worried about bringing it because i didn't know how many people was going to be outside for dinner but i really enjoyed dinner we ended up going to the asian place and um sean got this uh thai curry it didn't have curry in it but it was like thai right ri fried rice um with chicken and vegetables and then i got the sushi and the um shabu shabu soup and so the sushi presentation could have been a little better but it was good and then the soup y'all was banging like i know that's like a super simple dish to get but i just wanted to play it safe because i was gonna get the um thai fried rice what sean got but i just wanted him to get it so i could just taste it because I don't really like curry like that. Like I'm not really a curry person, so I didn't want it to have like a tangy taste to it and me not like it, but I enjoyed my little soup, girl. That was probably the best meal we didn't had so far here. Um, the burgers were pretty good earlier, but for the most part, we just been eating like wings and pizza and stuff from room service and stuff. So um, then the Michael Jackson show was really good. We caught bits and pieces of it because we got there a little bit late um, after we went to like the little dessert slash coffee shop or whatever. But them dudes can dance. Like I'm like, y'all really need to be on YouTube doing something because he can really dance like Michael Jackson. So now we're just going to prepare for tomorrow's excursion. We went ahead and booked a waterfall excursion. So we're going to actually get picked up at 6 35 a.m so that's why i don't have on no makeup i'm giving y'all real natural realness right now because i just didn't feel like getting ready i got a picture earlier um in my swimsuit or whatever but i just got on this little snake skin romper from fashion nova and yeah we're gonna go ahead and lay out all of our stuff pack up so all we have to do tomorrow is throw on our stuff and i will see y'all in the morning <laughs>
Yes. Video recording. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we finished our COVID test. We came two days before and they're gonna have it waiting for us at the concierge when we are ready to leave. I don't know why, but I'm always like so discombobulated after those COVID tests. Like all the tests that I've had have been like international tests. Like I haven't gotten one in the actual States, but Bella wasn't too bad. She was quick, fast. Um, it just always gets me. I don't know what's wrong with my na nasal passages but I always sneeze afterwards, it's so weird. <laughs> I wanted to give you a little resort tour, so this is the outside. <laughs> Hola. <laughs> and then this is the grand entrance when you come inside. Beautiful chairs on either side. This lobby area smells so good, giving very much luxury cologne, YSL Libre, Tom Ford vibes. I don't know, it's not focusing. There we go. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this again for y'all. This is the front desk area. And then we come in. This is where we got directions to go get our COVID test. That is the spa. You all will see that more tomorrow because we booked our hydrotherapy session for tomorrow. That's the elevators we took to go upstairs to get our COVID test. And then this is the beautiful main area it has the bar down there um gift shop and everything so i just love how open it looks and if you can see you can already see how beautiful the resort is outside and so this is where check-in was and we actually there's actually a bar back there Gracias. Thank you. Hey, you, have, you have any uh, mama, what's it called? Mama Juana. Mama Juana. Yes, here you go. Can she get a sample? She wants to try it. Oh, it's good. Mama Juana. Mama Juana. <laughs> I swear he was. <laughs> I swear. <Yeah>. Ooh. <laughs> mama Juana. Oh, wow. I literally see the cinnamon in there. Okay, yeah, we'll take a shot. We'll take a shot of that. Shot? It's, it's alcohol? Yeah. Oh, I did not know that. Oh, Lord. Ooh, it's a little dark. Ooh. So what's in the mama one? Normally, we put in rum, and honey. Oh, okay. 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 honey. Okay. 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 That actually Pressure. tastes pretty good. I'm sorry, y'all. It's dark. The sun is behind us, but it tastes pretty good. So this is like the drink of the Dominican Republic. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is inside the check-in. As you can see, it has the balcony, the bar over here where we just were. And so we're going outside. If you follow me on Instagram, this is where I first was um, when I had the champagne glass. So super excited because y'all look at this view like when they say excellence the the name speaks for itself like <laughs> <laughs> so like this is just like a cool place to come when you're checking in you're waiting on your room and stuff like that so yeah this is like the main building you can see that building all the way over there that's our building and then over to this building, that's where most of the restaurants and stuff are. So, of course, I'm gonna show y'all that. Just stay tuned. Okay, y'all, so picking back up on the resort tour, we are now downstairs on the main level of the lobby. Here's the bar to the side. 
We have a sitting area over here. This is one of the restaurants, Sports Bar. We haven't been there yet, but it looks like a pretty cool lounge area. Um, it's open for dinner. And then we have clothing shop over here. Looks like a jewelry shop. You can get your ice or whatever. We're probably not gonna go in there. But um, looks like you can get excursions. And then there's the thing over there. Hey, Easy, how's it going? <laughs> Good. Okay, so coming out of the gift shop, this is the other side of the lobby. And if you go out here, this is where the Michael Jackson show was. So this is like the entertainment area. So as you can see, you have these nice chairs here. That's the stage. You have a bar over here. And over here is where they do like the silent party so this is where we're gonna try to go tonight so yeah here's the stage that's where the DJ is gonna be and then this is where you come out to the main area this is the main lobby right here This is where most of the stuff is as far as food. You see up there, that is a restaurant. We haven't got a chance to eat there yet. But they have a patio area here. Hola. So this is where that coffee shop was. I didn't get a chance to record the night we actually went, but as y'all can see, everything kind of connects. So this is the other side of the sports bar. And then this is the coffee shop area. So cute and dainty. I'm not gonna go in there because we already kind of saw that before, but it has like ice cream, danishes. They have sandwiches too. It's a really cute little coffee shop vibe. So this is where most of the food is located and I'm gonna just give an overview because this part of the resort is such a vibe y'all like look how pretty this is I love the hanging like oval circles or whatever the staircase is amazing we have some seating over here it's such a vibe and so this is one of the places that we ate at before. It's called The Grill. We ate there for lunch. The burgers were really good. And then we had Spice. Um, the first night we were here, I think. Well, no, it was the second night. But as y'all can see, it's closed. This is like the hibachi place. And you actually have to have reservations. So we actually had to sit at the tables um, because we didn't have a reservation. But the food was really good. That was that soup that I had that was really good. And then you have the flavor market. Haven't tried that yet, but if you go upstairs, there's another restaurant up there. It was like the balcony one that I showed you all. Haven't got a chance to try that yet, but hopefully we can before we leave. Okay, so where we had um, breakfast, the um, first full day we were here on Thursday, it was called the kitchen table. The breakfast was okay. Um, I think I like the room service better, but it's kind of like a buffet style. It looks like it's closed right now, but this is kind of the vibe. So they have indoor seating and then they have outdoor seating too. Hola. Everyone is so nice here. So yeah, there's the outdoor seating. As y'all can see, this beautiful, lush, green plant. It's got the palm trees and everything. 
So I'm not gonna show y'all all the buildings, but y'all, this resort is super huge. So that's some buildings over there. Some more buildings. This is actually not our building. Our building is behind this little bar area. But as y'all can see, they have like the maps and everything here. Gorgeous views everywhere you go. I think this bar opens like for dinner. Usually people are there. But as y'all can see, this is so beautiful at night. I think I'm gonna bring my camera to dinner tonight because these little lanterns here look so good. I wish I could have those in my house. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and enjoy our rooftop pool because that's why we booked this place. So we just want to, you know, use all the amenities and stuff like that. So I'll show some footage of that, but I'm really loving it so far here and the staff are nice. The food is pretty good for the most part. Like I feel like compared to here, compared to Mexico, like I think I would prefer this over Mexico cause it just has a little bit more options and like the room service food is like way better than, you know, Mexico, but you know, not to say anything bad about Mexico, but I really do like it better here. So I'm gonna go ahead and get off this camera so I can change it to my swimsuit and I'll see y'all later. Hey y'all, so we are at dinner now. It took me forever to get ready. It's like 10, 22 right now. I feel like they're about to close, but they still took good. Um, so we got our appetizers. I wanted a Caesar salad, but I think it was like a communication breakdown. And so he brought me a, uh, a chicken salad but it still look good or whatever you know oh no i feel like the lights are gonna make it weird because i see the black anyways you turn the flash on um i don't think i need to turn the flash on i think it's just they have led lights in here um, salt and pipe thank you Gracias. Ooh, okay mm. that's a good stuff nice nice yes. <laughs> brought us like this pink champagne, which is super cute. Oh yeah, let me see it. This thing is not wanting to focus. Yeah. Yes, so, you know, we're just trying to make the most out of the last couple of days here. And we ordered steak. And how you feeling, babe? Excelente. Excelente. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we got our food. I got the strip steak with the potatoes all gratin and the roasted vegetables. And baby got, got the ribeye. Rib uh, mashed uh, potatoes, mixed vegetables. Yeah. Grilled vegetables. And he got... Um, and I got some mama wanas on the way. Yeah, he tried to get two more shots of mama wana. I don't know with the who's taking teams. that, but it's his birthday, so we might take them both by himself. <laughs> <laughs> but we're gonna enjoy our food. I just wanted to show y'all, we'll let y'all know how it tastes.
so sad but we just got done with the hydrotherapy session 10 out of 10 recommend I couldn't record everything because we were like jumping around to different parts of the pool or whatever but um, it was very relaxing very soothing and I feel like you know if you come here and you get excellence club you definitely need to take advantage of that free service um after we did the hydrotherapy session we went and ate at that restaurant up there it was okay the green enchiladas were good but this is a whole nother area of the resort that we didn't even come to until like the last day so um yeah we're just gonna walk on the beach it's so nice i did not realize how big this resort was it is amazing it's Oh my gosh, there's so many other buildings over here. That is crazy. Alright y'all, so now we are walking along the beach. I posted my TikTok um, a couple of days ago and somebody asked about like the seaweed on the beach and stuff. So as y'all can see, um, these tire tracks are from like them, you know, coming through and cleaning up all the seaweed. So everything is super clear, beautiful. So today we're just gonna take advantage of the resort. We were going to do a boat excursion. Um, it was like a VIP party boat or something like that. But the gag is the president of the Dominican Republic is not allowing excursions or tours to serve alcohol. Um, as of April 25th, he basically extended that executive order, if you will, for another 60 days. So if you're coming anytime soon, um, and you expect to have some alcohol on an excursion, they're not gonna have it. They're not even having food either. So it's just a safety measure that they're doing. I totally understand, but you know, we've been we've been a, in, on party boats in, in Mexico, Cabo, you know, Cancun, and you know, we did the yacht in Tulum or whatever. So we basically was like, it's no point in paying to just go on a boat. And plus the boats here are like, not as big as what we're used to like they're catamarans but they don't have like the nets or whatever so we're just gonna hang out here ain't that right boo ain't that right so yeah we just really enjoyed the hydrotherapy today we're gonna go see our friend from last night um was it jose lewis or juan lewis i keep getting the first name i think it's juan lewis but y'all he was so nice it's, it's probably the best service that we had here as y'all can see from the previous clip like you know he brought out his boys or whatever and was singing happy birthday to sean and stuff so we gotta go see we gotta go see our homie okay so you know he really made an impression on us and so we're gonna go see him later even if it's just for a drink um he's gonna be at an italian restaurant so we're gonna grab lunch there i know it was good. So we just we just might, you know, restaurant hop and do what we do. Um, and just enjoy ourselves. DR has been super fun, super relaxing. And you know, you ain't always gotta have a vacation packed with a lot of events, especially when you pay, you know, a good price for, you know, a jacuzzi, <laughs> a resort, all inclusive. A lot of stuff was included in our room. Exactly, we had a private pool. We're just now going to go. <laughs> we just now going to the main pool because we've been in our private pool the whole time. So I'm gonna go ahead and get off here. You know, I'll do like a little montage and stuff like that. But we just go hang out at the beach. Grab some uh, Coco Locos. Right. Exactly. All right. All right, y'all. So we finished up at the beach. 
pool popping now. It's about 2.45. Somebody definitely has their phone on the ox because they bumping that music. But I just wanted to show y'all. It's not totally dead out here. But it's just mostly relaxing and stuff. But main pool is definitely, definitely lit right now.